Cool, so I'm just getting everything ready. I'm gonna do a two days trip or one day maybe, I'll see, into Lee's paddock, which is a, I think it's a freehold. So it's got a hut up there. It's about uh, two to four hours, or two or three hours, maybe four, depending on how fast you walk um, along the river. So take my 45 litre pack, got to get all that stuff in there, and then some fishing gear. Um, still need to decide if I take two rods, I probably will see what I can fit. She's pretty tight with all this stuff, but just been slimming it down as much as possible. Cool, so good to go, everything's packed. I've had a bit of food, a bit to drink, pack's good to go. Managed to get everything in. Got my little bit of fishing gear on the outside wrapped around quite nicely. Uh, I think I'll take the net. I'll suss it out. It seems to fit all right. And I got both rods in the the rod um, tube. I could have taken them out, put them in a sock, but I don't know, I'd rather be a little bit safer than sorry. Um, cool. Not too heavy actually. It's a good thing about keeping it to 45 liters. Is uh, Forces you to, to pack lightish. Got a clean station here. Spray twice, heel to toe. Okay. Give them a bit of a scrub already. I should kill anything on the the outside. It's time now, 11:30. <laughs> Gosh, I have everything secure on my pack. <laughs> fall off in the middle of the river. And she is as well. So we're going to be fishing. Oh, so it's got quite a nice walk. Rainforesty, so it's quite shady. It's just good. Cools down a bit. Cool, so I just take a little detour and come check out waterfall. It's just a pretty uh, significant drop off. I don't know how the trout get up that. Just hit a little stream here. Oh, it's uh, pretty warm, the sun's out, it's very humid under these trees. Oh, just gonna fill up my filth water bottle. This is the benefit of not having to carry a lot of water. Oh, it's beautiful, fresh, clean, you could probably just... Oh, it's a little fish, short jump. That something fell in. Pretty easy going. This is the first bit of bit of a hill or incline, I should say. It's nothing really hill. Nice pleasant walk. Making pretty good time. It's been an hour so far. So this is the paddock I assume. I've just popped out of the rainforest. Look at those view, beautiful mountains. Just a fat feature and another one up there. Beautiful sort of valley here. The river's just down there. Uh, I assume the hut is further along this track, but I might walk the river. I don't really want to stay at the hut. I'd rather camp on the river. Um, so I might start checking it out. All right, it's a bit more protected in here. This looks quite nice here. Bit uneven, but we'll make it work. Cool.
far off. That's nice and cozy. Just be comfy and nice sleep. Cool, so camp's all set up. Um, just gonna have some, some lunch, made some rolls, some cheese and salami before I left. Some water, put the rods together and then we'll start working our way up the river here. A cup of coffee. There's some really small nymphs. I think we is that a mud eye? Yeah, mud eye. Look at that. <laughs> it's a baby dragonfly. So when he's ready to hatch, he'll go swim over to the oh sort of the grass over there or anything and crawl up it and uh, hatch out of there into a dragonfly. Yeah, it's a really, actually really small nymphs. Bloody me. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Just to hit the tree. With the, Just getting it in the end of there. Looking at sort of difficult. See a small fish over there. He's just cruised out. Yeah, this log then gone back under that overhanging tree. Just a little one. Ah, it's really annoying. I can see little fish following them. That was a good size um, for this river. Following them. So they're looking at them. They just like slowly following behind them. I don't know if it's the that's the fly or if it's presentation. Slime on it. Almost trot on this fella. Yeah. Kidna. It's a big fella as well. I haven't seen anyone that big before. Look at these little small fellas. Anyway, I'll leave him alone. Just tough fishing out there was a nice sort of one he came up had a look at the flies and that was about it ah, it's tough fishing it's not really interesting these nymphs and they're just pretty generic nymphs like a brown nymph Again, do that deep hole, cast it in, I can Polaroid. So when, once it got deep enough, the fish quickly swam up, looked at it, and then swam away. Hmm. That's steady. You see the fish following it here, and they're just looking at it. I've <laughs> jigged it up, done everything. I don't know. It's, just, it's, just, it's too big. I've tried the smallest nymphs I've got, tried different colours. <sighs> Finally, I have the smallest little nymph on, unweighted, and it's a little bit of a bird shot. I saw him come up to it. He had a look. And as soon as I saw him sort of look at it, I struck him. He must have just had it in his mouth. Nice. Fish. So yeah, maybe it was the size or it was really small little brown nymph. I don't really want to lose it because that's the only one I've got. <laughs> See you later. Finally. Oh. A tough day fishing. That's the size of the nymph I ended up putting on. 
smallest one in my box. <sighs> all right. It's quite good fun. There's so many fish all just scattered in these logs. You can just walk out the logs and dangle it almost. Uh, let's try it up here and see if it is actually the nymph now. I was just lucky with that fish. Second cast, straight after it. I've uh, got the little one. Oh, you know. I'm not even waiting for him now. As soon as I see him go up to it, I'm just striking. Look the size of that little trout. Beautiful. Oh, that was a little hit. Yes. Oh, it feels like I've got a bit of size. Oh, yeah, there's another nice fish. <laughs> Just goes to show how much I was casting, I was trying everything, and it was just the size of the nymph. Good fun now. <laughs> oh, he was a good luck size. I saw him, came up for it. Oh, beautiful. Oh, so much effort before. Oh, it's a good size fish. Scooped him. Try and get in this pool. little fish just cruising there but might have spooked him and standing in the sun ah there he goes oh not a bad size I was just fishing this little run there saw that oh saw the leader stop ah that was a bad fish it wasn't a bad fish saw the leader stop and that's when you strike right. um well, I might start heading back. It's seven o'clock. Um, there's a nice deep pool as well near where I'm camping. Well, I want to want to fish that quickly. Um, so I'll start making my way back now. Probably a kilometre or two. Ah, all in all, pretty good. Tough start. Well, I tried every fly in my box pretty much, and then remembered I had this little one, and I was like, oh, I'll just chuck that on then with some split shot to get it down. And lo and behold, straight away got a hook up, and since then I've hooked. You know, 10 odd fish. Ah, right, good fun. Let's have a little platypus. I just ran into a pretty big black snake back there as well. Or tiger snake, whichever they are. Had a big head on him. All right, so beautiful day. Not a cloud in the sky. Um, so just cook some breakfast. Just waiting for that to heat. Leave it in there for 10 minutes. Got coffee, ready to percolate, push that down couple of minutes I think I might pack up my tent 
Oh, I don't know if I'll take my gear with me or just leave it here because I'm going to go fish up a bit of the river which I didn't fish yesterday and then I don't know I might head back to the vehicle this afternoon just because it's such nice weather so there's a few lakes around here I wouldn't mind fishing um, with this sort of weather you can really sort of sight fish good fun this little one's along here I've cut back to the car um, oh he's been up a good little fight I'm um, just working a dry fly now with the little nymph underneath he smashed the dry just going for the smallest dry fly it's a little parachute that I've got Rainbow. <laughs> Still another little fish. So I don't know if he went for the top one. Yeah, there's about three goes. A little brown. End up taking the little mint. Oh, he's still down there. Oh, he's still down. Oh, he threw it. <laughs> Little one from the same pool. Oh, and the nymph as well. Oh, yeah, he's got a bit of fight in him. Just a little sort of green weighted nymph. A rainbow, the other one's a little brown. That one it's going after the caddis and the top fly. Going for it, might be a bit big for him. Don't mind the speed, Tim. Yes, there we go. Ah, oh, no. <laughs> oh, good fun. A oh, nice little one, really um, small rapids here. Oh, it's not a bad size. Compared to the other ones, really shallow. Just smashing that nymph. Come on. Oh, this is beautiful. 